Can you tell me a little bit about your background and why you decided to study photography? Hi, my name is Nora Cran and I graduated uh, level six photographic studies in 2020. And prior to that, I did level five in 2017. I've always been interested in taking images since my early teens, more snapshot formats, uh, family and friends recording the moment. Um, when I started studying um, digital and graphic design um, at Parsons School of Design in New York, um, I realized, or I was introduced to photography more as an art form. I uh, also realized it would enable me to take great portraits of uh, people um, and that has been a passion of mine is trying to capture the essence of a subject uh, as well as that I was uh, I had great access to wonderful exhibits in photography by some of the well-known photographers like Bresson and uh, Frank etc so I suppose my passion for photography has uh, increased year on year and that led me to start studying uh, photography at St. John's College. What was your experience on the Photographic Studies course at St. John's Central College? Uh, my experience of studying photography at St. John's has been wonderful. Um, I really couldn't rate it high enough. Uh, it's been, in my opinion, one of my uh, best life experiences. I suppose I have a passion for photography um, and I didn't realise when I was signing on for the photography course that I would um, learn so many new skills, be exposed to so many new photographers, taught by wonderful um, and passionate lecturers and I suppose I'd have to say my experience has been um, just overwhelmingly positive. What would you say to somebody who is interested in applying for a course at St. John's Central College? Um, I think, um, first of all, I highly recommend St. John's and I continue to date to anyone I meet who is interested in going back to education. Um, regardless of the subject matter. Um, from a personal perspective, um, studying photography at St. John's has been wonderful for me. Um, the lecturers, Padraig, Gillian, Aileen, Kieran, Catherine, um, they're at, they have a huge passion for photography um, and this um, actually makes you embrace the subject matter even more. Uh, they're photographers themselves and they demand that you work hard and that you um, give the class your all. And also um, as a college, there's great resources. They've just actually opened up a whole new wing now for photography, which is very exciting. And um, I think it's a wonderful college. I attended Parsons School of Design New York. It's highly renowned. I think St. John's in Cork is equally comparable. What advice would you give to a mature student who is on the fence applying? Um, I think if you're a mature student, uh, for me, I suppose some of the concerns you would have had would be like uh, going back to education. Will you be able to subject matter? Do you have enough, would you have the dedication to spend the time uh, studying, doing your assignments? Maybe you're a bit concerned about, um, you know, paying for the course. Also, um, maybe what's the age profile of the class? And um, I think they're all valid uh, reasons uh, of, for concern, but uh, shouldn't stop you studying photography uh, because I think um, all the students that are studying photography have a passion for photography. So um, they all embrace each other and they're all very helpful to each other. Also, if you have any a problem like reintegrating into education after a long time, the tutors are equally approachable and are there at uh, the drop of a hat to help you in any way you can. And um, the college itself is a great campus location. So I think if you have a passion in photography, you want to return to education, don't let anything stop you. I think any issue you encounter or problem is can be overcome and uh, St. John's will provide all the resources to overcome them. What final advice would you give to somebody who wants to study at St. John's Central College? 
Um, I think when you're, I'm going to talk uh, personally just to photography, I think uh, a couple of things that I learned from my first year is, uh, first of all, you get a great foundation in photography and uh, level five gives you that foundation. Level six then, it's kind of, it's very transformative because you probably take on your own practice more. You have the basics, very exciting. You learn about the zone system. For me personally, that just, um, opened up a whole new avenue in photography uh like trying to it, it made me it allows me now to use different tonalities uh contrasts which is something i always wanted to do and i learned that in uh the sixth year um also i think that um you just the only one piece of advice i would give is that the course is intense there is a, a heavy workload it's totally doable but i would say um as you once you start level five and level six just keep up with the assignments and when you come to submit your uh, end of year final um, work you'll have enough images to choose from what have you done since you left the course and what are your plans for the future well i'm currently back into full-time employment uh, non-photography related um, but in my spare time i continue to take images and um, I hope I'm building a portfolio of images at the moment and hoping to sell those eventually. Uh, also, I've done a couple of small projects for Friends of Friends, um, portraiture based, which has been a very exciting and also great le learning experience. Um, also, I started two large bodies of work when I was in college um, in 2017. I kicked them off and I worked over the last four years on them and submitted them as my final assignments um, in 2020. And they're not completed yet. I intend to continue to photograph um, those bodies of work for the next couple of years, ultimately hoping to exhibit locally and any images sold um funds would be put to a worthwhile fundraiser for my local community so very busy with photography still get great enjoyment um absolutely delighted i attended st john's and it allows me now to pursue my passion thank you